excellent year last year until he got hurt. That was part of the reason why the losing streak ended for Syracuse. The winning streak ended, rather. Schrader taking off here, making defenders miss, spinning away from defenders before he gets planted and loses the ball. Justin Maskell absolutely hammered Schrader, and he coughed it up and turned it over. Maskell, a starting defensive lineman, is gone for the rest of the game. Here's the hit, targeting. On third and seven, Klubnik in trouble, gets away on the run, throwing into the end zone, and it's caught for a touchdown by Stellato. What a great throw by Kate Klubnik on the run, eluding pressure from Isaiah Johnson on target, Stellato's first touchdown. Well, Rocky Long dialed up the blitz. Isaiah Johnson off the corner. He loses contain. Excellent. See that score, 42-6. Could have been much worse. Here's Schrader. In trouble. Sacked. And, boy, this guy, T.J. Parker, true freshman, has been phenomenal. For Clemson, that's his second sack of the year. Boy, T.J. Parker just plays this so well. Stays square, stays at balance. Also, mask on the backside with the pressure. Two freshman defensive end edge that we've had, and that's quite the statement. So productive early on this year. After the loss of seven, Schrader in trouble again, sacked again. So a Clemson team that had six sacks in the first four games has two already in this game, and it's T.J. Parker. If it's Tyler Davis is a speed rush. Watch the hands here from Tyler Davis. And then it's also T.J. Parker. Excellent job just getting separation, getting the rip up. Before tonight's game, as the ball's on the ground, and it's scooped up at the 25-yard line by Xavier Thomas inside the 10, and Thomas out of bounds inside the 5-yard line. For this Syracuse offense, second fumble already in the first quarter. This toss is high, up and behind him. Still, you think LaQuinn Allen can get his hands on it, can possess it. He does it on the ground. And Xavier Thomas, the senior, finally healthy, playing great. A scoop and almost a score. Bad pitch there by Garrett Schrader, Tom. That was way off. Behind him, up high. And Shipley is into the end zone for the touchdown. That's his second rushing touchdown and fourth overall this season. And Clemson out to a 13-0 lead. And lean on your talented running back. It's a good physical run by Will Shipley. So far for Syracuse have been the story. Schrader, again with pressure, able to complete it. Past the 40, a first down and more to the tight end, Dan Valari. All the way inside the 40 and Clemson down to the 36. A gain of 37 yards. To Dan Ballard. Boy, an excellent job locating the tight end out in the flats. And how about after the catch, the former quarterback. Extra offensive lineman in as well. So heavy package, and they're going to throw it. Trader, open receiver. It's caught inside the 10. Ballard, breaking tackles into the end zone. Touchdown, Syracuse. Short yard until play action. Here's Valari. He's just going to sneak out, and nobody's with him. And I love the job on the offensive line. The protection. Pocket is clean. He can step up, survey the field. Safeties get drawn in. Linebackers with the play action. And how about Valari? Since that hit, he does have his helmet on on the Clemson sideline. Klubnik. Pocket breaking down. He's sacked. Okachukwu with the takedown. Back near the 40-yard line, and that forces a Clemson punt. The, the loop inside. How about the spin move? Coming back inside by a Chukwu. Early second quarter. Klubnik over the middle in traffic. Nice throw by Klubnik out to midfield for Bo Collins. A first down gain of 16. Boy, big time throw. Costly mistake there. Don't do it, but still a bad call. There wasn't yeah. much there. No, Here there comes wasn't. a reverse to Adam Randall. And Randall's got speed and room inside the 20. Check that Tyler Brown, 15-yard line down to the 12. A gain of 24. Reverse action. Tyler Brown utilizing that speed. Nice job by Will Shipley. Club neck to throw, backing up. Syracuse will take over on downs. Leon Lowry in the backfield takes down Clubnick. Leon Lowry, the best edge rusher they have. And man, did he show up at a time.
friendly spot. Play action pass, good coverage in the end zone. Nobody's open. And Lowry with a good dip rip. Working on the best offensive lineman, Blake Miller. And he gets to the quarterback, Kate Clubbick, and he gets him down. Big. Schrader, design quarterback run, finds a hole. And Schrader, excellent athlete, gets the first down, takes another shot. From the Syracuse, 47. Play fake, Klubnik stepping up, taking a shot, receiver wide open, it's caught for a touchdown, Bo Collins got behind the defense, and Clemson goes up 20-7. to seven. Second touchdown pass of the first half for What's Kate Klubnik. the double move for Bo Collins, stutter, and then he's going to go, and Jeremiah Wilson gets caught right there trying to jump. The underneath route. Klubnik in trouble again, escaping the pocket again. And a receiver coming back to the ball. It's caught for a first down. It's Tyler Brown. It's a gain of play by Kate Klubnik, too. Just buys himself time, keeps his eyes down the field. And it's a great job by Brown, working away from the coverage of Clark. Excellent field position, either start a drive or after one play. For a good part of this game. Klubnik with time. Another deep ball going for Tyler Brown. And it's on target. Brown inside the 10. Another beautifully thrown ball by Kay Klubnik. The big pass. You're going to see single high safety. Barron's going to work down into the box at the snap. And as soon as Kay Klubnik sees that. Clemson looking to put Syracuse away with a touchdown on this drive. Quick throw. Burning still. The ball comes out. Can Syracuse get to it in bounds? They do. It's scooped up by Bellamy and returned to the Clemson 42. The fumble recovery is going to stand, and it's because Bellamy does an excellent job of understanding where he's at on the field. It's close, but he keeps that foot in bounds, scoops it clean, and never touches the white and goes out of bounds. Huge play. How many times have we seen Schrader drop back to throw and then just take off and run? He'll throw it here on second down. Receiver open. It's Alford. It's caught inside the 10. Alford slung out of bounds inside the 5. They finally find the big guy. 40 and a first down. Well, they move around. Now he's in the slot. Corner blitz comes. Nobody stays with Damian Alford. They take the points if they don't get in here. Schrader to the air. Looking. Lobbing. End zone. Catches in the bowl game last year and a big score here. Man to man coverage. Jeremiah Trotter loses a step on the Quinn Allen. That ball perfectly placed. Plenty of air underneath it. And they empty it out here. Schrader back to throw. Fires over the middle. Trotter with a great play. Picks it off at the 32 yard line. Eyes on the quarterback. Going to drop right back into this zone. Eyes on the quarterback. Trying to work the football to Alford. Working out of that inside receiver position. Full extension and an excellent, excellent play and takeaway for Jeremiah Charter Jr. You can't draw it up any better than that. Up 10. He's going to pound it. Maffa and Maffa is gone. Syracuse got stuck close to the line of scrimmage. Maffa broke through that first line of defense and then easily scampered into the end zone for a touchdown that might put Syracuse away. The offensive line, simple counter action, 77, 78. Gonna get out in front. It's Mitchell Mays, it's Blake Miller. And you'll see the patience and the cutback by Phil Maffa. Blocked by Blake Miller, gets Clark out of the way. And Maffa to the house with no orange defenders anywhere in sight. Well blocked, well executed, and the Clemson Tigers going on the road. Looking like they're going to cruise through. On there about trying to get back into the mix, and then you start two and two, but give these players and coaches a ton of credit against a previously unbeaten Syracuse team. Carlos Del Rio Wilson out to the 26. I mean, you think about the tone setter.